So it's been a little bit since I really posted a video because I've been very busy. I got a new shop. I opened the shop August 1st and now it's uh, September 2nd and it's been a busy month. Yes. It's going to continue being busy because we're continually moving. I started out the month jam-packed. I had a bunch of cars lined up, or a bunch of cyber trucks really. We had a family vacation, so it was really only three weeks in August. I wrapped eight vehicles, six cyber trucks, and two Model Xs. Now, one of them was my wife's Model X. I'll show you inside, although right now it is a little dirty. We had to pull everything out of the shop area because I'll show you that in a second. Um, it's getting some work done. So as you walk in, nice sitting area here. Of course, we're gonna decorate. I just kind of threw some things in here. And you might remember this place. This was the larger place that we were looking at when uh, the two places we were looking at. There's not much available here in Mooresville. And uh, this, is, this is one of them. I don't need that much space up front here, but this is an office. There's a room in there where I'm gonna have some parts. This is gonna be a break room back in here. Work being done back there. This is where I cut up all the material. There's some stuff on the walls uh, and then parts here. So I have everything out of the shop into here because we're redecorating that area. And I'm gonna show you that in a little bit here. Uh, just imagine this all posters on the wall, cars, you know, parts displayed, nice couch area, TV going, maybe playing some I want Tesla videos and um, Somewhere where you can come in and you know sit and wait for your car while you're getting a new yoke put in your Model 3 or or the cyber wheel put in your Model Y or something like that. So let me show you out there what we're doing in the warehouse. It's 2,000 square foot and I, I got lighting coming in there. But right now you might hear some machines going, but we're gonna take a look at it. So this is the back half of the building and you see right there I'm getting a new floor put in. This is my neighbor actually does this for a living and he, he's a great dude. So if you're in the market for uh, either any kind of epoxy floor for your garage or patio or anything like that, if you want the flakes or anything in there, that's what they do. We're doing a light gray epoxy over the whole thing. He's filling in all the cracks so it looks like one smooth surface. I, I'm so excited after seeing this part. This is the, they grind the material down or well, they grind the surface down, fill all the cracks, we're gonna grind it again, and then tomorrow we're gonna be start, they're gonna start laying the color, and then there's another layer of color, and then the uh, clear coat goes over top of that on Thursday. So if you're in the market in the Charlotte area and you want a floor done, check him out. This is a really cool company. You could buy those floors from Lowe's or Home Depot or something like that and do it yourself. Those aren't gonna last, and those aren't really made for a car to be parked on. You want something that's not gonna come up from your tires. You want something that's gonna last a long time. That, that's what this is. That's what you need for your garage. You know, Swiss Tracks floors are great that I have at the house, but they trap dirt. This is gonna be a lot easier to clean, get all the debris out of there, sweep, maybe even use a leaf blower. But uh, this is the way to go, for sure. But anyway, I have plenty of parking back here, so when we do have an event, because we're gonna have a grand opening party here, Soon, I'll let you know exactly when, probably end of September, maybe, I don't know yet, gotta figure all that stuff out, gotta finish everything in here. So I don't know if you can tell that I'm super excited about all this stuff, but let me tell you what we do here, actually. We offer, obviously, wraps. Wrapping PPF, wrapping vinyl, uh, ceramic coating, window tint, parts install. So if you have a, like I said before, if you have a yoke that you wanna put in your Model Y or Model 3, or even put a round wheel into a Model S or the, the stocks for the Model S and Model X because getting rid of them, kind of a pain in the butt. So uh, if you have those, you want those installed, I install parts here. Basically anything for your Tesla or EV, I can even paint brake calipers. I just did that on a Rivian. And uh, so we can do all that here. 
But this is an exciting adventure, a uh, big change from just YouTube. And for the people that have been following me for a long time, you know, I used to be a carpenter, I used to build furniture, and then I got into YouTube, and then I stopped the, I, I put everything into YouTube, and you know, now we're taking what I did with YouTube, turning it into a business, which is helping out a lot of people because a lot of you don't know where to go to get stuff installed uh, or where to get your wrap done that someone that knows what they're doing with your Tesla, uh, someone that you feel comfortable with and maybe get to see the process because I may uh, I may record a video on it and show other people. Maybe not a satin black cyber truck because I've done six of those already, but yeah. it's exciting for people to see you know their vehicle being worked on. And just like it's exciting for me to see my shop being worked on. This is a five year lease here. I'm gonna be here for a while. So if you have a, a Tesla or any vehicle that wants that you want wrapped, hit me up. There's obviously information down below. And I'm glad they're doing this on a holiday. I mean, I didn't ask them to do it on a holiday, but you know, that way these businesses aren't hearing the noise. But uh, these guys are doing an amazing job. I can't wait to see the color on it tomorrow and, uh, and get a car. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is so cool.